Those at the Smyrna Police Department tried to treat the morning shift meeting like any other day, but the special guest somehow stood out. It was early, and even though seven-year-old Darian seemed to be excited to be here, he was still waking up. Then he was called to the front of the room. Got a proclamation by the mayor of the city of Smyrna. It proclaimed Darian as an official officer for the day. Once on the road, that's when the real police work began. Sir, do you have your driver's license with you today? First, pulling over a man who allegedly blew through a stop sign. I ran a stop sign? I didn't see a stop sign. Officer Darian was having no parts of that. He helped fill out the ticket and shield it with his John Hancock. A bit further on the beat, he was briefed about an alleged copper thief they were to be on the lookout for. They got a call that the suspect had been spotted. The kid-sized cop speeds to the scene. Soon he's slapping on the cuffs and leading the suspect away. He didn't seem shy at all. He hops right out of the car, uh, starts up to the biggest guy that uh, I've seen locked up in a while, and uh, handles the arrest just fine. Darian is diagnosed with neurofibromatosis. He has tumors throughout his body, including three on the brain and two on his optical nerve. He suffers from seizures, headaches, and migraines. His wish to be a police officer is close to his mother's heart. Son saw me go through a lot of domestic um, abuse in the home and he didn't want other kids uh, other women to have to experience it so he wanted to be the one that can put them all the bad people away and this, he is one of the happiest kids in the world right now in smyrna eric phillips channel 2 action news